Hello guys, <clears throat> I'm Yudi and uh, this fifth video from Unified Networking Club video series. In this video I will show you how to prepare your web browsers to use on-click to call out Telnet or VNC sessions. The first, you have to prepare a couple of REC files. Uh, let's jump into Networking Club and let's say Telnet for search. Uh, this one. If you're going down, here you can see how to prepare your REC files. Uh, you can take any of REC files, but additionally you have to assign these commands for keys as uh, so for REC file. I already prepared my files and uh, this one. Yeah, it's and uh, if you are going inside, yeah, it's uh, uh, there is a uh, two options. It's very very popular. That's a freeware. Uh, what you can use for telnet sessions on click if you are clicking on node on UNL, uh, it is a putty. It is a freeware, and if you are looking on this page, you are just just clicking on the. Uh, yeah, it works. Yeah, it's it's going directly to the site, and you can download a party. Uh, and the Ultra VNC, Ultra VNC is necessary because some of nodes has no serial ports, and that's why we can't use a telnet, but we have to use a Ultra uh, VNC yeah, for accessing to the consoles of these nodes. Nodes, for example, ASAV uh, version nine to nine three two hundred. All right. So, uh, I will show you that after download your putty, it's uh, be sure that you are storing storing this putty somewhere somewhere in some place which not be changed in in the future, and uh, that's edit and reg file. My reg file looks like this. Yeah, it's a universal one, and you can use absolutely the same. That's just a rewrite this, yeah, but be sure that your potty is placed in in your storage. Yeah, it's a, this pass is correct where your potty is stored. Yeah, it's a not to be changed. All right. So, but I personally I like it says secure CRT because uh, it it can tab a session. Yeah, it's it is like one window. It's not like a putty open all consoles and then separate windows. Yeah, so that's that's why I'm like yeah, so just for testing purposes I'm showing the one lapse running and uh, the switch number two is uh, use, using the telnet session on the left left corner left low corner you can see that this is a telnet session to 172.21 1 1.15 to the port uh, 32770. Yeah, it's if I'm clicking, yeah, it's it's opening my session. Yeah, it's an I guess see. So, but I downloaded downloaded just right now in a putty, and I'm going to change my console click to putty. Let's do. So I'm going inside again to verify if the pass is all right. Yeah, it's a pass for putty. Click. Yeah, so just copy, you can just copy it. Yeah, and to verify. Yeah, see so users down on desktop. Yeah, guys, del double delimiters is a must. Yeah, it's a, the, just be, be sure that you have a double delimiters between your paths. Yeah, it's a, because the simple path is one delimiter, but in a, in a rec file should be two. All right, I'm going to install now the the potty talent okay i'm installing saying yes it is added to registry and let's do the click now look at this and now i'm using the potty potty is not my favorite i'm going back and change to crt in a crt as well you have to be sure that the pass is correct where the series secure crt is stored yeah the, the uh the letter T means that the all sessions will open in a tab, in a one window, like a, like a tabs. All right. So this is my correct pass, and I'm going to change back my CRT. All right. Add it to registry, and clicking on a switch now. Look at this, and I'm using the CRT now. 
So the VNC, the VNC, for example, A say V, if you are looking on a left low corner, it is uh, VNC to session 172.25.115 to the port 32.772. So for this, for this use, use, we have to download Ultra VNC. You can go from Andreas site. Yeah, Ultra VNC, just in the grab download downloads. Ultra VNC and grab the last one. It's a 205. This is the best, and I'm using it eight as well. It's, uh, I'm using the 64 bits, and I'm downloading. Once it's done, be sure that you are taking this unit lab repository. There are very very good. Uh, uh, let's say it's necessary things for VNC. You can download like a zip. I already downloaded. And let's inside. Here is it. And you can see the rec file is prepared. It is no need any of changes anymore for 64 bits. But you can see that we have the wrapper here. After installation of VNC, if you are going to System Program Files and the Find Out Ultra VNC BFBA, this is a program folder file uh, folder for Ultra VNC, and going inside and copy this vnc wrapper bot file here it will it will call out your sessions if you need for on uh, let's say on click yeah it's if you click on, on test uh, in a lab yeah, so let's test because i have already installed my ultra vnc and placed this bot file in correct place just let's check and so i'm clicking on asa and here we are so the steps are simple just prepare your mm -hmm. folder. Just prepare your uh, rack file. Yeah, correct the pass. Yeah, be sure that the putty is placed is placed and store it in correct place. Yeah, it's install this this rack file and push. Everything is done. And about VNC, I just I just show. And just show you. Thank you for viewing.